Something I feel about my generation specifically is that we don't want to be tied down to a nine to five. My path to web development started honestly by accident. Uh, I went to college like a lot of people do, got a job, you know, started working full time. And it wasn't until a year into that job I realized, okay, I don't think this is what I want to do for the rest of my life. I became a comic book writer when I, I took an internship in New York City. Because that recession hit right when I was pursuing my first degree, I felt like it was harder to find opportunities. As a freelancer, you're kind of going from check to check. Once you start to build those contacts, then, you know, the work becomes steady. I got a really good job working on the Navajo Nation on an oral health research project, and the job had budget cuts, so I got kind of laid off. And I had to take an ego check in a little bit because I had to do these crappy jobs for a long time until I got an email from a mentor of mine, hey, look at this job. I think it fits you perfectly. My job is something where there are not as many people educated in that field, so there's just a high demand. That did help inform my decision. It didn't determine it because I was already really interested in education, so I knew I would end up in that field. For me, programming just, to me, was the new industrial revolution. It's a skill set, it's a craft that, to me, applies to any industry. I'm not getting any younger, and the older you get, you want to plan for things in the future, you know, like potentially family, marriage, you know, maybe a house. Is comic book writing a traditional job? No, it's not. But what I trade for, you know, a retirement count um, I get with uh, artistic freedom. Without the current position that I'm in, um, I wouldn't be where, where I'm going right now. People say, like, pick yourself up by your bootstraps, and I know it's not that way. I say sometimes to myself, like, I'm one of the most ambitious people I know, but I couldn't have done it alone.